ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, we here at Pop House have got a fun video for you today. It's another viewer's suggestion. We're going to go through the cog from the Gears of War, and then after that, maybe the next time we're going to do, the, well, not maybe, we are going to do the Locust. I thought I'd do this in two parts, so it's not such a long video. It's a lot of fun doing these. I hope you enjoy them. They're not always my most watch for views, but they're my most watch for time. <laughs> So it works out. I mean, I get more hours on them. If you like these things, drop a like. If you want to see the one for you, let me know. Like I said, I've got the gears coming. I still have Halo. I've been asked for Star Wars. So we got a lot of this stuff coming to you. It's a lot of fun to do things for the fans and do them for you guys because that's what I started this for. You know, if there's questions you want, like Vegeta was talking to us in the chat on the stream. He wanted to talk about what grails are. I'm going to gladly cover all that. You know, I'd like to get a few more questions. So if y'all want to put a bunch of questions in the queue for me, that would sure make a nice video. I'll answer as many of them as I can for you. But on that note, let's get this thing queued and get it started. Welcome to, Welcome to, Welcome to Pop, Pop House. Just a little quick once over of my collection. As you see, the cog's pretty thin there. Ooh, whoa. Brought to add something in here. Feel bad. <clears throat> my display did not look right. There we go. There's my display. Alright, as it's coming around here, we're going to start with this big McFarlane. This is Old Man Marcus from Gears of War 4. I'm trying to lower it down so you can see it right there on that base. I hope this stays in frame. This things are These things are just huge. You can see all the detail on Old Man Marcus here. He's pretty cool. I've got some other stuff in this Gears collection. It's going to be a little bit of a longer one, spinning everything up. That there's Old Man Marcus. I'd like to show you this golden cog, but it does not stand without something helping it. Pretty cool. Another McFarlane. We had a lot of these. The boys ended up ended up playing with them. Didn't want too good with it. Just because I don't want to take it out of box. There's my golden Marcus. It ain't any reason. It ain't worth nothing. I'm just being lazy. Because we got so much to do. I mean, because literally, we have so much here. Here's my Jack. Jack is supposed to have his little things on him. But he crashed the first time I flew him. So I didn't like him on there. I didn't think they made him look good. So I cut him off. So he looks like Jack. It was a drone. A lot of detail in this jack. I thought it was pretty cool. Like I said, we're just going to do the cog today. I don't have them all. There's a few that I'm missing that I would love to have. Um, there's a Marcus where he's holding the locust head. I don't have that. Alright, as Jack comes around here, we've got so many things to get through. There's Jack. I'll be right back after I resize this. All right. Here we go. I'm going to sound bad. I don't remember his name. I should, but I don't. He's JD's friend. If you choose right, he's the one that died. <laughs> I sure hope you didn't choose JD to die. He's pretty cool. He's holding the buzz saw there, as you see. All right. Try and do a little bit of these things as everything comes in. As he comes back around, I'm going to do this. Got a lot of these pins I'm going to show off. This is a Gears Pop pins. You can see them in there. They got Marcus. They got Scourge. They got Anya. And they got the Queen. Here you go. This is her uncle. You know what's bad? It's again another one of these. I knew him as uncle. I don't know his name. Really kind of bad. Some of these, these first two here, I just don't know their names. I don't have the full set. Like I don't have a Carmine. Like I said, I don't have the Marcus holding the locust head. He comes around. Now this here is Cat. 
She kind of becomes a main character in five, but not quite. But I still think it's going to come back around. But right now, Cat's sort of the main character. Like I said, I like doing these fan ones and showing off these collections. It took me a hard time to get. I mean, I looked for a lot of these for a long time. I'm still looking for some of them parts to complete the sets. It's just neat to be able to show you my collection, what all I've done. Let me know if there's anything else right now. I've got the Locust, I've got Halo, and I've got Star Wars coming up with these fan request sets. So I got a bunch of them. I will be getting through them all as fast as I can, trying to keep everything mixed up so it doesn't get stale. Here you go, JD. You know, it's funny because JD, when he looked like this, wasn't a very popular character. A lot of people didn't like him. You know, it's kind of funny, but I always thought he was a decent character. I liked the little stain. I mean, there's a glow-in-the-dark one of these. I didn't bother because I guess, you know, I wasn't a super JD. You play the DB1, Damon Baird, came with that set. And then this little pin. Oops, had it upside down. From the tank, from the gears. JD comes back around. I'm trying to show you the stuff when they're on the back. And there's JD. Here you go with his mom, Anya. This is more from Gears 3. Anya. Show you my cogs. Wait, I like that. I've been showing these off on the backs. I don't know. I always figured the backs of these are kind of cool, but they're almost all the same. It's a lot of the suits and that, so I figured it's a good time. They so go around and show you like the Gears of War cogs. Property of the Coalition of Ordered Governments. Yo, there's Anya. Get her out of there. Now here's where we start the big team. Woo! Coal train, baby! Whole train runs coal train runs on whole grain, baby! Woo! You know how that is? The coal train. Come on, all y'all play Gears of War, you know coal train. You did the little thing the woo when you were in the grocery store. You know it. Come on. Pretty cool pop. Cole's definitely one of my favorites. So you can guess what four I'm down to now. We're moving into the main team here. And Carmine's another one. I do not have a Carmine. Haven't broke down and bought that one yet. Haven't found a good one. Here you go. Damien Baird. DB. Damien Baird. You know he traded her for bacon. Even though he marries her. Any man that marries him knows he traded him for bacon. Damien Baird. Let me know. What's your favorite one of the main four? Did you have a favorite? Was it Coltrane? Was it Baird? Was it Marcus? Was it Dom? Did you like the newer characters better? Did you even play Gears of War? Gears of War is definitely one of my favorite games of all time. I could sit down and play the campaign right now and not even have a problem. I love that game. There's Damian Baird. Here you go, Dom. Come on. If you played the game, if you played the game, no spoilers here, but when Dom passed, you cried. You had to put his wife down. There was a tear in your eye. Dom had one of the saddest, roughest stories in this game. I keep waiting for him to come back. They never do. They brought him back as a zombie, but only as a little joke into the multiplayer. Never actually back into the game. I kept waiting to hear him come back for some reason. 
Nope, no dumb. All right. Main event time. Marcus Phoenix. This is definitely the main guy when it comes to Gears of War. If you play, you know, one well, of the main characters, Marcus Phoenix. Although I do think if they make the movie, Dave Batista would be an awesome Marcus Phoenix, and he is trying for it. So, all right, Marcus Phoenix. Hopefully y'all had fun doing this. I've had a lot of fun doing all these requests. Just keep the requests coming. Like I said, I'm going to do this. I've got Halo and I've got uh, Star Wars coming up. So I got three more coming. If you liked what you saw, make sure and drop me a like today. I'd really appreciate it. Sure helps YouTube tell people to add me to that algorithm. Woo! Hopefully you had a lot of fun with that and I heard your like. Go ahead and drop a like on this thing. It really helps YouTube tell people that my videos are good, gets more suggestions, gets me out there. We've been kind of stuck at this 173 for a minute. Just kind of let's get us over that because, you know, we're pushing for that 200. I want to do another giveaway. I don't know if we're going to do it at the 200 give mark or just do it just for the heck of it. We'll see how things go. So, hey, drop a like if you did like this. Go ahead and put a comment down there. Give me some questions of what you want me to talk about. I want to do a video. But I need some questions from you guys. Just answering viewers' mail. Thought it'd be kind of fun. Drop that in there. Okay, on that note, it's been kind of a long video. I hope y'all had a good day because I know I did. Hope you leave your days as blessed as mine. I'm filming this on my daughter's birthday. She's already asleep. Miss Lorna, know that daddy loves you. And on that note, peace.